Okay, I feel like we are gonna get started. Okay, guys. Hello, hello, hello. I, we are recording and it's eight o'clock and we are ready to go with this new rep training. So I wanna just say hi to everybody and um, I actually want to, okay, let's see, Melissa, I'm going to unmute you, and I just want to, hi, um, okay, can you, can you give me a heads up if you can still see me? Yep, I can still see you. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much for that. Okay, you guys, I want to welcome you to um, Team Papaya's new rep training. I'm really, really excited to be hosting this call for Sarah Anderson. And um, if we're on this call, if you're on this call tonight, you are somewhere in her downline. Um, and we have all kinds of branches of teams on this call tonight. So welcome. I am very excited. My name's Tev Bracken. I'm in Oklahoma right now. Um, a little bit about me. I have been a Zaya rep for three years. I'm going to get into my story later, but I've got, I've been married for 16 years and I've got two kiddos who it's, who they're fighting me for a shower right now. But, um, I want to welcome you on this call tonight because if you are on this call, you are doing the right thing. You're doing the right thing right now for your business. I believe that there is a perfect timing for everything. And this is your perfect timing. You said yes to this opportunity to rep activewear, to rep Zaya activewear, and it's going to be amazing. So I have a few notes that I wanted, that I took, that I wrote, that I want to share with you. Um, and then we're going to be doing a question and answer session at the end of this call. So if you said yes, this is the time. The company is taking off. If um, we're open in Canada and the United States, and if you don't know, we're opening in Australia. So that is amazing. The word on the street is in January. So we're really excited about that. So growth is all around you. Growth is all around you. And we're about to dig into exactly how you can get that growth and how to achieve that growth. So at Team, P Team Papaya, which that is our umbrella team, we have a deep belief that guiding women in building a solid business will make a positive difference in your life, in your family's life, and therefore making your community a better place. So it's way more than a community of just leggings, of just repping activewear. We are, um, we have strong beliefs and strong values. And you're gonna see that the more you engage with Team Zaya Papaya and your team and your upline, the more you can just build that team culture, you will see exactly what I'm talking about. So um, we also value family first and foremost. We are all busy, right? We are all doing all the things. Trust me, <laughs> we're, I know. I know you, you guys are on this call at eight o'clock at night. It's because you have taken priority um, for your business because you can be doing so many more things, but we're all busy. The secret to being successful in your business is showing up. That is, that is the secret, show up. If you learn how to show up consistently and in a, in a little bit every way, you will see big things happen for you and your business. And when businesses are built, families are blessed. And we also believe that balance can be achieved in your home and your work. So we have a successful formula that guides you and we share all we know in how to achieve it. We value our containers being full and healthy because serving is a foundational piece of a good life and we encourage it regularly. So that little piece of information is so true. Um, just coming from a place of um, just having so much balance in your life with your new business and your family and all the things that you're juggling, or if this is a side hustle or if you have something else going on, you are, you will fall into a family that can guide you and guide you in the right way to having all your containers um, completely balanced. So a little bit about my Zaya background and about my story is I became a Zaya rep in 2018. 
I, it was in October and I didn't really do anything with it in like until December. Um, but that's not what we're going to do here. So I jumped in in December because it was just really good timing. Um, I was kind of in a gray area in my life and, um, my kids were a little bit younger at, at you know, three years ago. And I knew that I had gifts. I knew that I had talents. I knew I was blessed with so much more. And I knew that I could, um, and I still do. I still feel like I'm blessed with so much more that I can give women that I can offer. Um, but Zaya has been that platform for me. So um, it's not just about that sale. At first it was, and it's all about growing my business. But Zaya for me has really um, let me blossom into a person that I'm proud of being, um, doing these face, these, um, you know, live calls and, and so much more there. It's absolutely amazing. What, if you take that step, what Zaya can do for you, because each and every one of you knows your talents, you know, what you're made of, you know, the gifts that you have, you know, the service that you can do. And it's in every single one of us. Um, let Zaya be your platform into, into doing better things for you. So that's a little bit about my story. I'm an, and I'm an, excuse me, an exec at Zaya and I have a team 31 active, which if there's anyone on here from team 31 active surprise, I didn't even tell you I was hosting this call tonight. So I wanted it to be a surprise for you guys. And so I hope it is. Um, but our team is almost 400 reps strong and we have awesome, awesome, um, just leadership and women, and we all come from a place of serving and we all have talent. So really law, really just, um, be thinking about that whenever you're connecting, because there's somebody that you're going to connect with that's going to be life changing for you. So Moving on, I want to talk about your launch and your launch success that you can have. So um, you are responsible for your launch, right? So you have an, a sponsor or an enroller or an upline, and that person is going to be your mentor, okay? So launching your business is the first step to success. This is where you are responsible for being resourceful. And I'm going to show you how to do that in just a little bit. So if you were a brick and mortar store, you would have a grand opening, you would have a ribbon cutting, and you would also be paying overhead and all that stuff, but we're not. So your launch is essentially telling the world that you are wide open for business. And if you haven't set a time and date for this, do so now, text your upline and set it up, whether it's a pop-up launch, or if it's a... Um, just a, a Facebook launch or anything, set your launch party up because your warm market is going to go crazy over our products. Okay, our goal on Team Zaya Papaya is to help you earn your kit investment back within the first 30 days. Um, I have been successful in doing that and I feel like so many people have too if you do your launch events. So money in the hands of women is a good thing and it can bless many families and many communities. So um, the tools available for you for success, this is where I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna share my screen and show you. Let's see here. Okay, bear with me. Um, let's see. No, that's not it. Okay, let me see if this is it. Okay, can you guys see my screen? Melissa, yes, thank you. Okay, are you seeing te uh, Team Zaya Papaya's website? Okay, perfect. Okay, so this is Team Zaya Papaya's website that Sarah has created for all of us, and it is amazing. Not only is it like easy on the eyes, it's like up to date with all of um, the current scripts and all of that stuff. This is where you're going to be resourceful. This is where you're going to dig in, <clears throat> and it'll have a progress check for you. And so um, getting started is amazing. This 
team website should have been emailed to you by your upline. If it hasn't, it will be. If you need it, send your upline a message and get this um, website working for you. This is everything that you need. Um, it has welcome and launch guide. So it will it will explain completely how to get to net, get connected, back office basics. Um, this is a little bit about Sarah's team here. Um, it'll go on to talk about your business launch, launch party tips, launch to v your VIP page, which is where your all of your customer base is going to go. Um, it's going to talk to you about follow ups, warm market and cold market. Excuse me one moment. And frequently asked questions. So parties, rank advancements, and so much more. So really, really utilize our team website um, because this is where it's going to help you. There's also special trainings. I want to say special trainings on like time management. And um, that is my weakness. Um, time zones, those are my weaknesses. So all call recordings, if you ever miss a team call, they're also on the team website. Um, leadership is on here. So go through your team website. I'm going to stop sharing my screen so I can go back. But I just wanted to show you guys a little bit about what that looked like. Okay, bear with me really, really quick. Okay, is my screen still shared? Okay, hold on guys, hold on. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh goodness. Okay. Okay, now everybody's hidden. Just a minute, just a minute. Y'all bear with me. Um, oh, gosh. This is so not cool. Oh, here we are. Here we are. Okay. Um, did it stop? Okay, see, when you run into problems, you just keep, okay, there we go. You just keep going, right? I'm fixing to talk all about that. <laughs> okay, moving on. Um, Melissa, are we good to go? Okay, so um, that is all about being resourceful. That is our website. That is our team website. Um, and it's amazing. So one thing I want to tell you going forward is I learned this from the very the very beginning is do not have paralysis by analysis. Do not sit there and study so much that you're just stuck and you can't do anything. Study a little bit and then go for it. Study a little bit and then take that step. Does that make sense? Like don't don't be stuck in it. And so um, don't let others people's opinions keep you from me moving forward. That's also a really big one I want to share with you. Don't let other people's opinions keep you guys from moving forward. Um, it's just unhealthy and you want to stay in your own lane and you want to do you. And we don't care what anybody else thinks. So, um, okay, moving on to business expectations. You, I, I want to say like, you can put your own expectations on yourself. You know what you're capable of. Um, at first, you might feel a little uncomfortable and you should because this is something that you're new at. Don't think that you need to do it all or to have you need to know it all at once to be good at it right away because that comes with practice and practice comes with being consistent and consistent comes from just showing up every single day. So you have a sponsor or an enroller who is your personal mentor and they will answer your questions and guide you through the resources. So keep in mind that 50% is the, 
is uh, greater than 0%. So even if you're doing it and you're not really sure how, if you're doing it right, you're still doing it. And that's a win because action brings results and perfection doesn't. And we do not want to be perfect. perfect. We don't. Um, there is going to be lulls and bumps along the way. And that's totally normal. We call those seasons in this business. We have a season for learning and seasons for um, all kinds of things. And you're going to experience them. But as you're transitioning from a warm market client base, because all of you guys as new reps are in a warm market. I'm three years as a Zaya rep and I'm still in my warm market. So um, just depending on what your reach is, all your friends and families are gonna be your customers and that's where you're gonna start. So if you experience a lull, it's fine. Just keep moving forward and your cold market customer base will grow and you'll find yourself with a sustainable growing business. So don't think for one second, you are the only one experiencing it because once you um, just mesh with our team and our culture, everybody is just here to build everybody else up. So don't wait to grow your team. Um, like, don't ever think like, I don't know enough to grow my team or um, I need to do something else before I sign on a rep. No, that's absolutely not true. Start now. Your sponsor will help you. Um, and it's honestly so much better learning with the partner alongside of you because it, it makes it more fun. So it goes without saying, but if you want to earn the six figures that is completely doable with this business, you have to treat it like a six figure business. Um, copy the reps that have achieved it and show up for your business the way you want. Successful reps host about four or more parties a month and they show up daily on social media and they have one-on-one -on -one conversations with um, people every single day about becoming reps. I know I do. And um, if a couple hundred dollars is what you're after, then you're going to need to host one to two events a month and post online regularly. Um, if you work this business like a hobby, it will pay you like a hobby. But if you work this business like a business, it'll pay you like a business. So just keep that in mind. So tips for success. Um, it's really, okay, if you're going to take notes on anything at all, take them right here on what I'm going to say. It is really easy to get distracted. Um, all the shiny things around us, all of, the, of what everybody else is doing, focus on your IPAs, focus on your income producing activities. That is the big picture. And those are posting on your social media. Um, that is hosting events and that is con connecting with people. So posting on social media, if it helps you to have a content calendar, like Sunday, you're gonna do um, team reminders. Monday, you're gonna do outfit of the day. Tuesday, you're gonna do a Zaya fabric tip. Wednesday's new releases. Thursday, you're gonna do something completely funny. Whatever your content calendar says, Stick with that and post and be consistent because the people who see you be consistent are going to be your really good customers. Um, host parties and connect with people. This business is super simple. It really is simple. We have um, a proven dupli duplicatable, that's not a word, duplicatable system that is successful and we keep it that way. So if you're feeling overwhelmed, take a hard look at where you're spending your time and make sure it is with the three above IPAs, the three above income producing activities, posting, hosting, and connecting. Um, show up for your team calls, just like you're doing tonight, because team calls create the culture, right? And then wear the clothes daily, like wear them, post your outfit of the day. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're going to learn down the way down the road. There's an app called like Beauty Pro or Beauty Plus, and it will like automatically put makeup like a makeup filter on you and you can post your outfit of the day. It has saved me numerous times because I, um, you know, I roll out of bed and I put my leggings on and I, I'm like scary to look at, but um, apps along the way are going to be your very best friend. So post your OOTDs and use your GIFs and um Yes, I absolutely do all that stuff. Okay, wear and share the clothes. And then consistency always trumps. This business model works. Keep going. 
We are so excited for you and your new business. Congratulations on being here. We can't wait for you to earn your investment kit back, which is our goal, and see what you're doing 30 days from today. So yes, that was my little spill. And I want to open this up for questions and answers. Um, and I hope that I can answer them. So if you want to unmute yourself, you can and just answer away. And if not, I, I mean, we can find the answer surely somewhere. I had a question about, um, I've noticed a lot on Tammy. Um, I'm in Ontario, hey, in Ontario, Canada. Um, I've seen a lot of uh, reps posting um, like pictures of the products um, in really neat ways. Where do we find that information? Yes, that is a great question. So here on Team Zaya Papaya, we have a rule that anybody who um, shares graphics or shares pictures are able to uh, just keep on sharing them unless they're watercolored. Watercolored means like if you have a picture um, and you stamp it with your brand or Zaya.Tammy, then you don't really want to share somebody else's watercolor picture on your site. So um, pictures are, you can pull them from the website. Your back office has pictures. And um, on Wednesday, new releases, you're going to get emailed product pictures. And so th they will have a couple of different ones from those. And then the way that they make them cute is there's an app called Canva or Over. Those are probably the two most important ones. And you can use those apps to create your graphics. I use, um, I kind of cheat and have a, um, a VA or a virtual assistant who creates my graphics and I can share her name with you. She's on our team and she's amazing. So um, if you want me to do that, I can because I'm not. I'm not creative enough to do that. So yeah, yeah. Pull from other people's. You're gonna find um, you're gonna find a lot of graphics once you start digging in, and you'll you'll get better and better. When I first started, my graphics were horrible, and now I there there's just there's an improvement. So you'll learn along the way, but just start sharing. And how do I know the difference between U.S. prices and Canadian prices? So because some of the groups overlap with Canadian people involved with American. Um, people in the same teams. Yeah, uh, a lot of them will post graphics with prices. How do you know which ones are U.S. and which ones are Canadian? Yep, that's a great question. A lot of um, a lot of the graphics should say it. And um, if you're in Ontario, once you kind of get the website going, um, you're going to know like a pair of black and tight leggings are sixty nine dollars in the U.S. That's our price. I, I absolutely know that because I see it all the time. So you're going to know what your prices are. Um, I always feel like when I see Canadian prices, they're higher and they're mm -hmm. they're not. It's not like an even price. It's always like a an like extra ninety nine dollars or yeah. Yeah, it's like an extra something or other. And I'm like, oh, that's Canada. And so um, I feel like you're going to get to know, but check your back office and make sure that those prices link up before you post. Because mm -hmm. I have I have post um, new release Wednesday from Canada on my VIP page. And everybody was like, what is going on? So <laughs> you make a mistake and you go on with it. People are going to love you for just being you. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. anybody else have a question ask away while we're here this is what we're here for this is to learn this is to um get it all out uh do you have a facebook group that we should be in so i um yes so if you're on this call you are part of team zaya papaya and you should be in Team Zai Papaya's Facebook group. And from there, you will also be in your um, uplines group. So I'm my team is 31 active. And um, that is, you know, that's my Facebook group. When I had my launch party, something I want to tell you guys about launch parties is if you do a launch party on Facebook or Instagram, that launch party will become your Facebook VIP page or that that launch party will become your page where your customers are already in there. That's warm market customers. 
That's where you're going to post Wednesday releases every Wednesday. That's where you're going to do your own little sales um, where you're going to add value, maybe your favorite makeup tips. Um, people, people, your customers, they, they're in there because they trust you and they know that they're in there to buy Zaya, but they also like to hear like, you know what, this is my favorite um, take when I do packaging and I just thought I wanted to add value to your day and share this with you. It's amazing how much people want value in their lives. So also keep that in mind when you're growing your VIP groups. So does that make sense? Okay. So is the name of the Facebook group Team Zaya Papaya? Yes. Okay, thank you. Yes, yeah. Um, yes, Team Zaya Papaya. And then um, I don't know if it's an invite only group or if you can join. I okay. can't I can't remember, but ask to join that group because you will find a plethora of women in there um, that we are all a part of that group. We all have that in common. Or the or whoever signed you up should have a team page. And if they don't, then you're going to go to Team Zaya Papaya. Hey, Tav. Hi, Dee. How are you? I'm so good. How are you? Surprise. <laughs> we got a quick, my struggle is getting people to get on my lot when I'm actually doing lives. So like I'll send out the, like the invites, but I've had a few that are like, well, I clicked on your link and I couldn't get on it. So I'm, I'm trying to figure out what's the best way where it's enticing for people to jump on when I'm actually going live. Do you know if there's like a better way besides just saying, Hey, I'm going live at this time. And then you hit your live. Yeah. You can say, Hey, I'm going, I'm going live and I'm going to be nude at noon and they're all going to jump on. No. <laughs> okay. Um, I like to, um, so that is also something that's really, um, I have struggled with that too. Um, but don't let going live and nobody getting on your call, stop you from going live. Um, right. one there, people are either busy, um, but something that you can do is you can do a small giveaway on your live. So you can say, Hey, if you jump on my live at noon, I'm going to give away this, um, Zaya beanie. And I want, I want engagement and something else that you can do is you can text me or you can text your upline. You can text your friends like, Hey, jump on my live because the more people that are on your live and um, Facebook will recognize it and there's a certain algorithm and it's going to post more. And so I would jump on your live. I'll set my alarm and jump on for you. And the more interaction that you can get, I feel like the more it's going to be seen by more, by more people. Okay. But definitely do, I mean, even if you do like a $5 uh, Starbucks giveaway for those people who jump on your live to support you, I think that would help. Okay. Did you see the question in the chat? Okay, let's do this. Thank you for reminding me that there's a chat. Um, okay, hi. Okay, Lori. Um, I'm reading your question. Where do the bonuses come from when you host a party where members win discounts? Okay. So whenever you host a party, um, you're, you're, okay, so whenever you host a party, the discounts and, and the awards, let me see if I got this right, come from Zaya themselves. So we have different tiers. Um, if you host a party and you sell $200 and you have three orders, you're going to get, is it, is it 20 or $25 in credit and two half off items? 
So that is that is something that Zaya Corporate offers to anybody who hosts a party. And then the next tier is if you host, um, have a $600 party with three orders minimum, you will get 60, 60 or $65 in credit and three half offs. And then it goes to a thousand dollar party. You get four half off items and 150. Um, so those are the tiers. And there's one more, a $2,000 party, $300 in credit and eight half off items, which is a lot of Zaya. So, um, Yes. So if you're hosting your own event, you yourself will reap those rewards and you can cash in on them. Say you're hosting an event for Susie and Susie has a thousand dollar party. You still will get that commission from Susie, but Susie's going to get those rewards. So she's going to get her free and half off Zaya. Does that make sense? Um, sure, you can offer those separately to your members, right? So say I have a party right now for $1,000 that I want to close out. Um, it's just kind of uh, hanging around in my back office and it's been there for a while. And all of a sudden I want to support my, my customers. So I will go on my VIP page and I will say, okay, you guys, I'm giving away $150 in free Zaya credit, and I can break that up into I'm giving away a free bomber bra this week or a free pair of leggings this week. Or I can even say, okay, I have got four half off items that I want to give away um, as a gift or like for hosting a party, I can cash those in on that. So yes, you can absolutely give away and disperse those um, rewards however you want to your customers or your VIP page or even your team. Absolutely. Yes. People love getting engaged. They love um, playing games and, and running, winning rewards. Yes. And so D, that's something else. If you have hostess credits too, you could also jump on and say, um, I have a half off item to give anybody who's on this live event at noon. Yeah. So my question to that one is, <clears throat> when you go to close a party, do you have to immediately use the half credits or the credits that you've actually gotten for it right then and there? Mm -hmm. Or can you actually hang out in your back office? Yep. So you can actually have your event for as long as you want in your back office. But when you go to close your event, you're going to have to use your party credits right then and there. You it's a one time thing. When you close your event, it's they're good. They're done. You okay. can't go back and use them once your event's done. So you can say you can um, if you have an event, you can just kind of set it up like um, within a week, you can gather your orders and then close your event at the end of that week and then cash out all your rewards then. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and another thing I did learn, which given that we're all new reps, um, is that I had some open parties that some of um, my customers just wanted to be able to add on a couple more weeks to it so one of the things I did learn because I actually have like three of them that are already pat, were past the 30-day mark so when they went to go to place an order their shop their party shop link didn't show up anymore mm -hmm. so I found out when I called customer service because I'm like it all that you just have that your date stay within that 30 days of when um, you've started their link. So if I started in September, then I have to go back in if it's gone past the 30 days and update it. So it stays within the 30 days in order for that link to show up, which I never knew. So I'm just passing on what I learned. Yes, that's awesome. Um, for those of you who don't know, um, that is very important what Dee just said. So you can have a party, um, open in your back office and say, um, it got to $600 and it's been there for two or three months, when you go to pull that party back open and say you wanna keep growing it to a thousand, you're just gonna to have to go and reset your dates to the current date. And that party will, and will just remain open and it'll show on your website and you can continue to grow that party. So that is 
I mean, it's phenomenal how Zaya can allow us to um, even even place orders and place orders from party to party to where it go it grows to fit oh. the reps. It's amazing. Thank you, Dee. Good. And why you call these? Why? Does anybody else have a question? Hey, I have a question. It's Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Can you hear me? Yes, I'm so glad you're on tonight. Hey. Hey. Okay. So when you when you do your leggings and you'll say, um, I'm gonna anybody who orders these leggings get ten dollars off today. So where does that come from? Does that come from you or you have money built up in your back office. And then the other thing is, is um, all of your clothes from Zaya, is it, does it all come from parties or, um, I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm looking for a word. I know what you're trying to say. I, okay. So whenever I offer um, something in my event, so Michelle's referencing an event that we just had as a team. We had a fall event and um, it was um, a couple of hostess that came together. So it was like a bash that was like a, a rep bash. And I did promos throughout the week that were um, if, if somebody bought a pair of leggings on Monday, they got $10 off. And so there's a number of ways that you can do that in your back office. You can go and purchase a gift card for however much you want for say it's ten dollars and then you can share that gift card with the rep who purchased um and then they can use that at whatever time but something that you need to keep in mind about gift cards is if you purchase a gift card on my website for Susie Susie can only um Susie can only spend that ten dollars on my website she can't go to michelle's website and spend that ten dollars so if i wanted to to build michelle's business as my downline i would purchase a ten dollar gift card from michelle's website and michelle could give that to Susie. so what i did in my party that's one way you can do it what i did was i just venmoed them ten dollars it's super easy and they're getting $10 off a pair of leggings. And I feel like Venmo is safe. You can PayPal if they don't have Venmo. Um, and, and so that's how I did the $10. I just Venmoed them. Um, but I know I had made so much this month. And then I know I have so much to give this month, much to my downline and to my team and my drawings. And that's something that you'll, as your team builds and as your business builds, you're going to keep that in mind. Like, okay, this month I'm going to have $25 to give away. And then you can split that up however you want. And then second part of your question was, do I get all my, how do I get all my Zaya? Um, I think the way that you um, were saying that was this and tell me if I'm wrong. So my rack of Zaya clothes, my samples here, I'll turn. I keep all of my samples here on this rack. Um, everything Zaya goes on that rack. I wear it, I wash it, I put it on that rack. When people come over, I can roll that rack out. They can see my samples because they're clean. Um, and I keep my, my samples all neat and nice on organized hangers. My hangers match. It's just really good. Um, it's a good way to present it. When the company is not here and they don't want to see Zaya, I will roll it back into my bedroom. And so most everything, probably 99% of everything on the Zaya rack was purchased from a party that I closed. So I got all of this for half off and free um, because I will host, I will have events going every single month for my customers and all of those orders or under my name. So I'm hosting my own events. I'm making commission on my own events and I'm cashing out on my own events. So I usually try to grow my event to a thousand dollars and then I cash out because I will get $150 worth of Zai credit and three um, and four half off items. And um, something that I do afterward is you can always, Zaya has a really high 
resale value. And you can always sell your um, Zaya on a Facebook page and you can um, get some cash for it. So there's, there's that, which is not bad. <laughs> Michelle, was that kind of what you were asking? That was it. Thank okay. you. Um, so yes, take it all in steps, you guys. Um, your sales are going to come in steps. You're going to learn every single day that you're doing something. Always open your computer first thing in the morning and look at your back office. Make that a habit because that habit is um, it's going to it's going to get your numbers growing. And I think first and foremost, what needs to be on everybody's mind is recruiting. Um, sales are what's going to get you income in the beginning, but recruiting is what's going to get you income on the long run. That's what's going to create that residual income. That's the beauty of direct sales. That's the beauty of our business. That's the goal that we're all after. I can sell and sell every month, but if you want to take a vacation and not work, you're going to have to recruit. That's the residual income. Um, that's where, that's where the beauty of this all comes in. So if recruiting's on your mind, you're going to recruit. If selling's on your mind, you're going to sell. So you can do both. Um, make sure your container stays balanced. That makes sense. And we love building teams. We love recruiting. Um, where in your back office would you find the photos of the product? Okay. If you go um, <laughs> under company files, okay. you're going to find, um, I think there's recent product launches. Um, you're going to find all of the photos. You're going to find your logos as well. Um, but yeah, so they're all going to be there. And then make sure you know what your what your first goal is. Um, something that I didn't talk about that's really important is make sure what is your first goal. That is that should be to hit junior rep, and junior rep is super easy. Every single one of you on here can hit junior rep, and you should um, give your allow yourself. Um, you you guys all know your limits, and so whatever you're you're capable of put like set a goal, whether it's in for your first month as a Zaya rep or your second, set a goal to become junior rep. Um, it takes one person on your team to become junior rep, one good party and one good party for them. Um, if I'm not, okay, junior rep, you have to have a personal volume of $200 in sales, which you can do that. Um, your lifetime personal volume has to be 1500 in sales which you can do that. So if you're a hustler, you're going to get that done in a month. Um, you can also get that, get that done in two months for sure. And then your one sign up underneath you has to have sales of $600 and you're a junior rep. You rank, you rank advanced in the company. You get this beautiful bracelet that Zaya sends you. And so um, there in your starter kit, you're going to see a picture like, or a paper like this. Mine is super old. But there's a chart here and it has all of Zaya's rank advancements. Pick one out and set your eyes on it and make it your goal. And maybe it's not junior rep, maybe it's director, maybe it's senior director, maybe it's executive. So set your eyes on that goal and don't let anybody or anything tell you that you can't do it because you can. Okay, anyone else? Going once, going twice. Y'all, this has been such a good, a good thing. My husband got the kids in bed. I don't have to tonight. <laughs> Woo, love it. Okay. All right, guys, I am signing off. Thank you so much for being on this call with me. My name's Tev Bracken. 
You can connect with me on, it's not Ted, it's Tev, T-E-V. You can connect with me on Facebook or Instagram. Facebook, it's, it's Tevery. I'll type it in here because it's kind of, um, send me a friend request if you want to connect. And then that is Facebook. And then it's Tev Bracken on Instagram or Zayat Autism. I don't know, I've got a couple handles, so anyway, I'll put those there for you guys. If you have any questions, I'm here. You don't have to be on my team. It's, you just ask me, so. Tammy, you're welcome. It was my, it was my pleasure. Um, I really do wanna hear that all of you guys have a goal in the next 30 days and that you're just killing it, and so. Yes, connect with your teams. Watch out for um, our next get together. The next Zaya gathering is going to be called Base Camp. So, um, whoever your upline is, you should be hosting something Base Camp ish wise to gather. And so, you guys, that's in March. So, um, it's never too early to plan something. Or even if you have a team by then, you can host Base Camp. So, yeah. Okay, guys, signing off. Everyone have a lovely evening and I will see you in Team Zaya Papaya.